What's going on guys, Sam Man back with another review. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at the brand new McFarlane Toys. Right here we have the McFarlane Toys 12 inch digital Superman. This is from DC Direct and this is going to be a Jim Lee inspired statue. Now this cool thing about this statue, one, it's Superman, two, it's got a cloth cape. I mean, and it's got a bendy wire cape in it, I believe. I, I am so excited to have this. I hope they do a Batman version of this. I mean, we got a Jim Lee Batman hush, but we don't have the Batman to go with this statue. So if you guys know the iconic Jim Lee cover that he did with Batman and Superman, there is the Superman cover right here. So you have him standing on top of that statue. And then there's a Batman one that should be going hand in hand with this. So I hope he actually does do this. So it says Superman by Jim Lee, digital copy. Now we're gonna go ahead and open this up. Now if you wanna pick this up, this is available right now at Big Bad Toy Store, link in the description down below. Let's go ahead and open this up and see if this is gonna be a pickup or a pass. All right, before we look at the statue, what you get is your, your usual. You get the Superman card, your McFarlane card. And there's a little bit of a bio right there in the back. You get the digital code right over here. I've never actually used these. And then you get your digital base right here. It says McFarlane Digital Digital Toys. So it would be cool if they, again, if they actually had a logo with like a Superman, a Superman logo. So outside of the packaging, I'll get you guys a close up on the head sculpt. I think it looks pretty good. What do you guys think? Does that look like your Superman? I don't know. I don't think it looks bad. I think it looks good. This is all sculpted right here. You got the S on the chest. The paint apps on this is really good. And he's got like texture also throughout the, the suit. Yeah, it doesn't look bad. I like the pose that he's in. You have the statue right here that he's standing on. I don't, I don't, I don't know, if, I wouldn't say it's like really a gargoyle. It almost looks like a bird. It is kind of like a, like a soft rubber material. Again, they if you look closely on the pants, he does have like some texture in the suit, which looks really nice. And then you got the yellow belt. Again, very muscular body. Now he doesn't have an S on the cape. So I don't know if that's gonna upset a lot of people, but there's no S on the cape. You lift the cape up here, and then you can see the back of the body. Um, I think it looks good. I don't think it looks bad. I mean, the, the head sculpt itself does look, it does look comic accurate. I think it looks really, really, Really good here. Now the statue itself, he does stand perfectly fine on his own. You don't need the base to get this guy to stand up. You, it, it, it's really not necessary. If you turn him around, it, it, it like depending on where you put him, but this table is a little bit uneven. He doesn't really need the base, but if you want to use the base, use it, unless you have an uneven, uneven table like this one right here. And then again, you have the cloth cape, so you can kind of get this to go, you know, however, you want to display it, push, pushing it to the side. It's really up to you. And again, there is a bendy wire. Um, here is a close look at the cape here. Again, it doesn't have the S on it, which is uh, which is kind of unfortunate. It's probably going to upset a lot of people that there's no S on the on the cape. But again, I love the bendy wires on these statues, and I love that he's doing that on these. But let's get another close up here. What do you guys think, though? The, like the head sculpt. I think the head sculpt looks good. What do you guys think? Here, I'll get you another close up here. I think it looks good. It's not bad. The outfit is really nice. I mean, the sculpting itself on this figure looks really, really good. So that's my little quick little review, guys, on the brand new McFarlane Toys digital copy, well, digital toys, I guess you can call it, Superman by Jim Lee's art. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think, if this is gonna be a pickup, is it a pass? And again, depending on where you have this bad boy, you really don't need the base to get him to stand. And honestly, I mean, I think the base looks cool. I just, I think it should just say Superman on there, at least like DC Comics. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below if this is a pickup, is it a pass? And again, I did get this from BigBadToyStore.com. Link in the description down below. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this review. We'll see you guys soon. Later.